Welcome everybody to Fishing with Jet. Today, I got a video for you where I'm gonna show you my navigation light setup. It's something that I've spent a whole lot of time on trying to figure out the best way of doing it. I'm like every other person out there. I'm trying to limit the amount of times that I put a hole in my Pelican Bass Raider. So I'm just gonna take a moment, I'm gonna show you all, you know, my navigation setup. I hope y'all like it. At the very least, you know what I'm saying, it give, it'll give someone else out there an idea that may be better than mine. So let's get right on to the video. Okay, we're gonna start with the things that you're gonna need to make this project go. First, you're gonna need some type of battery powered drill. And you're gonna need some drill bits. Um, you're gonna need some PVC pipe uh, cutters. You'll need a black Sharpie marker. You'll need some zip ties, some scissors, a little, I call them little butterfly net, two of the uh, three fourths inch uh, PVC cap, two of those. And you're gonna need, um, you don't need that much. You only need just a small portion of this, but I have a um, three fourths inch PVC pipe that's gonna be needed. Okay, as you can see, I didn't go the absolute cheapest way. I actually went a way that I wanted to make sure that I'm I'm seen on the water. I want to not cut too many corners when it come down to uh, navigation lights. At the end of the day, I'm all about trying to be safe on the water and get back home to my family. So I went on the uh, Guardian Angel website. It's a pretty nice website. I chose the Micro Series Navigation Lights. Um, it comes with two. One that's the, um, you know, your white light and one that's your, uh, your red and green light. Um, also in the package that you get, you also get two tethers for, for each um, light. Um, you got a choice to either get the eight inch tether or just a, a 16 inch tether. And it also comes with uh, two mounts that's like magnetized and you can also screw them in um, to put on the surface or whatever. So all that come in this package and this package is not really that cheap, you know what I'm saying? It, it really kind of costs a little bit. I think this package, if I can remember correctly, was $156 um, for the whole package. But again, I want it to be 100% safe on the water. Okay, the next thing that I'm going to use in this project is some form of a milk crate. And the next thing that I, I'm going to use in this thing is actually a telescopic, I'm not sure exactly what you call this thing, but it, it holds your phone on it. But we're going to use this in this project. So let's get on to the next part of this video.
That's not enough. 